All right, uh, let's look at uh, exam one, problem number three. All right, so part A. So we want to find the uh, value of this definite integral uh, using a geometrical, a geometric uh, method. All right, so let's do that. All right, first, uh, we try to uh, sketch the graph of absolute value of x minus one. So let's do that. All right, so x minus one, uh, which looks like, uh, so uh, slope is one and uh, negative one is the y-intercept. Uh, so uh, it should look uh, somewhat like this. All right, so I'll just do a dotted line for now. So it's gonna start from negative one, and then uh, slope is one. So it looks like this, if it were just uh, x minus one, All right? And uh, absolute value sign, uh, what it does is that if it's negative, it's gonna turn into a positive value. So these guys will be flipped over up here. So it's gonna look like this. So uh, absolute value of x minus one uh, looks like this. All right, then uh, x value is going from zero to four. So starting from here, all the way to four. I think uh, there's a four around here. All right, so from zero, which is right here, all the way to uh, one, two, three, four. All right, so the region that we're looking at is a combination of these uh, two triangles. All right, so we know what to do. Uh, so in terms of area, so triangle is one half uh, base times height. Uh, in this case, this little one, base is one, height is one. So one half, one times one is going to be the area. And this bigger one, uh, base is three and height is three. So it's a one half and base is three and height is three, All right? So which is gonna give you, uh, this is one half, plus uh, this is three times three, so it's nine halves. So it's a 10 halves, which is equal to five. So therefore, the value of the definite integral is five, All right? Let's look at the part B, All right? Part B, uh, y equals square root of uh, nine minus x squared. So this is actually a semicircle with radius three. Uh, nine is a three squared, so radius is three, right? So it's gonna go through, um, uh, so it's gonna go through here, three, a negative three, and here a positive three, and a positive three. And I'll do my best to draw a circle, a semicircle. So here is the semicircle. All right. Then uh, it's going from negative three to positive three, so that's gonna be the entire uh, semicircle. So I'm gonna just shade it. So this is what we're looking at. So the given integral in part B represents the area of this um, semicircle or semi-disc, all right? So which is going to be, since it's a semi-disc, so it's gonna be a one half of the whole thing, all right, then area of the circle is uh, pi r squared. So in this case, so you have a pi, and the radius is three squared, all right? So that's going to be uh, nine pi over two, all right? So nine pi over two is the value of this in, uh, definite integral, which is the same as the area of this uh, semicircle, all right? That's it. I hope that, uh, that uh, this was clear.